Hello once again YouTube family. Thank you for tuning in in today's video. I'm going to review the Cezanne trench coat which I believe the best uh, trench coat I've owned so far and I've been looking for it for quite a long time. So I do hope you stay tuned for the rest of the video. I'm going to talk about the pricing, the quality, just overall review how much I bought it for. And if you're new to my channel, please click the subscribe button you'll get notified first thing if i upload any videos and also make sure that it will you know add value to you and um uh, at the same time for those of you who are new i'm christine i'm an entrepreneur i do run to uh, business and um, currently it's going well so thank you so much for tuning in in today's video so here it is everyone um uh, just got it actually I love it as you can see a uh, great quality I got this uh, straight from France having a look at the color it's beautiful it's perfect and at the back it has that small detail first of all let's talk about quality it's very thick fabric by the way guys as you can see and it's also fully lined which I love it also goes through the a sleeve as well so that's uh, an excellent quality I believe and the fabric itself is very thick as you can see if I can just quickly yeah just to show you guys that's the fabric itself I couldn't ask any you know anything more than this quality to be honest with you and at the back as I said it has that uh, button you know I don't know what it's for but it's just a nice add to it I guess and um, yeah so you do have this uh, thing on the arm that makes it extra and also you know to matches it it has it has got it on the shoulder as well so that's the, um, the quali quality of it and the belt of course it's nice and very good it also has that that button it's just to make sure that the belt stays in place so i'm very happy that i've got this uh, beautiful beautiful trench coat now let's talk about the sizing look i'm usually australian size 6 i'm 157 centimeter in height that is about five five inch one foot so five one with the sizing i went for the size up because Recently, I prefer more of the oversized, you know, fit. But I'm, I think I'm so happy that I bought the uh, size 36 instead of size 34. Because during winter time, I did manage to wear this and I've doubled up on my, you know, inside. So that is something that you might want to consider. In terms of the length, I'll probably get up here for you guys just to show you so it does sit pretty well like how i wanted it but i love the length of it on me so it just fits definitely right if you are looking for a little bit of an oversized look please get one size up i'm usually size or showing six i did get the equivalent to size eight uh, this one so here you go guys just to have a closer look and in terms of the arm, it just fits just right. So it does covers my whole arm if I do it like that. But I'm very happy with the with the size eight, and I'm glad I did size up. I got it for 410 Australian dollar. That depends on the currency, right, and the exchange rate. But that's how much I bought it for. Just a heads up as well this is always out of stock okay so for those of you who wanted to buy it when you see it available you know get it um, if not you just have to sign up with them and you get notified that it's back on stock okay so that's another tip for you there in terms of you know buying this trench coat because it's always sold out overall i do love this trench coat i just wanted to show you how it looks like when i have it you know uh, tied up like this so um it's one of the best uh, trench coat it's very beautiful overall quality overall review with this trench coat 
I do love it if you're hesitating to get it. It's a bit pricey, but I believe it's an investment that will last you for a long time. And that's the thing with uh, my wardrobe now. I did choose to kind of lean in towards the neutral classic color. And that's why I chose this particular color as well, because I do want it to just be, you know, nice and not anything, you know, not thinking about any color coordination or anything like that. So um, I do definitely leaning into more of a neutral and um, a more classic color in my wardrobe. I mean, I'm not, I'm not getting young anymore. And so I'm very, you know, I'm very particular with the clothes that I choose now, making sure it's quality, it's gonna last, it's classic, something that I could wear over and over again and guys i do hope that you like this video share it with your friends if you find it you know something this is something that they, they are looking for and please comment down below let me know if you have any questions i'm here to help you and i do hope you have a good day i'm out for uh, lunch and i'll see you guys on my next video thank you